Hello folks, I'm back again and uh, I've got the tape recorder to play it does play a tape and it actually plays it quite well, it's a bit low but I don't think the problem is with the audio with the audio amp because there's plenty in the audio amp I think the problem is the tape head, so I'll have to try and get another one. But I think that's where that could be a challenge, couldn't it, getting the tape head for this thing? But anyway, I'll put it on and let you have a quick listen. You're tuned to Radio Caroline on 199. Just lift the head up a bit. It's now exactly 8 o'clock, Bulova watch time. B U L O V A Bulova, the world's largest makers of quality Swiss watches. Good morning everyone, Tony Blackburn here with you, feeling a little under the weather this morning. We've got a, about an eight force gale out there flying, so I'm strapped in the seat this morning. Hoping that you're going to enjoy all the music. This is number one in the countdown this week. From the Spencer Davis group, it's called Keep On Running. As you can see, that could do, probably be a do with a clean. Uh, wind. Wind, winds the tape on. I haven't tried recording yet. This, although it's got that noisy bearing, now it's in the machine. It's actually not that bad. Rewind. Playback. Go to the next one. See, there's plenty there. Give that switch a bit wiggle. I don't think that's got how to do with it. And that tape's moved down and that won't help it. Let's try again. And that's full volume that. So whatever type of hair you have, but if I plug if I put if I put screwdriver in the input Plug that in. See, we've got plenty. 
plenty of output. So the power amp's working okay. So it's either it's either a valve in the preamp. So it's either a valve in the preamp uh, or the tape head. But uh, I think it's the tape head to be honest. Let's stop that. Right. Uh, well, I don't think. Well, I know for a fact uh, the valves that this uses. I know for a fact, folks. I've got none. I know that. So I'm not even going to bother looking through my stash because I know there's no valves in here for this. That needs to clean, but you know. Uh, other than that, uh, other than sorting out the low audio, which I think is the tape head, I definitely think it's the head. If any of you have any ideas, then let me know because there is plenty of output there. It's not like it's, it's not like it's low. You know, it's not like it's low on output. It's got plenty there. I mean, you do the buzz test. There's loads of power there. Loads of output. So the audio amplifier is driving well. So it's got to be something in the preamp, uh, but I think it's the uh, I think it, I think it's the actual tape head itself. Uh, but what I'm going to do, I'm going to try and look around and see if we can get all of a tape head, a, a known good one, one that's been tested. I'm not going to buy one that's just been pulled out of a machine somewhere. I do want to buy one that I know is good. Uh, you know. And I mean, I've just got an awkward fingernail there, folks. There we go. Uh, you know, I want to buy one that's good. Both speeds on this work, by the way. If I just turn it back on, I'll show you. Uh, drop the speed. There we go. Uh, <laughs> go pulls the tape through a bit quick now. There we go. There we go. Hey. I need to sort that switch out. But other than that, uh, there probably won't be another video on it now, unless uh, I have to do any more circuit work. But if I have to change a valve, I might. Well, I will. I'll do one more video on this in the series. Uh, that'll be explaining whether it was a valve or not and telling you that the machine's repaired and letting you hear it good and proper but uh, you know we've got to the point where we want to get to where we can actually play a tape where it will it will now play a tape and the mechanism it runs really good and there's there's very little wow or flutter I couldn't really pick any up um, you know although the idler's not in the best shape it's uh, you know, I think it's uh, I think it's performing pretty well, folks. To be perfectly honest, uh, I've got to put the front all back in here and shit like that. But uh, yeah, I'm pleased with my results so far. Anyway, thanks for keeping up with the series. There'll be one more video. I will do one more. I don't know when. It'll be whenever I find either a head or a replacement valves. But I, I think it, I think it's valves. Uh, sorry, I think it's the head. Because, uh, uh, you know, what I'm going to do, I'm actually going to make a recording. I'm not going to make one now because I ain't got a microphone. Uh, actually, I could plug that guitar in and do that, couldn't I? Yeah, bear with me, folks. I'll just do that. I'll just do, I'll do it. I'll, I'll, I'll set that up. Wait, I'll be back in a minute. Right, I'm back, folks. And as you can hear, look, if I turn the volume up, look at that. <laughs> plenty in it so it's not the amp so if I put it into record uh, right so we'll, 
I don't know whether that's going to record, I don't know whether that's the right one for record or whether you put it in the other one. Well that'll be enough anyway, so let's stop that, unplug that because we won't get any... Rewind. There we go. So it might be the other socket for record. Right. Let's try that. Stop that. Wind. Well, we've got some hum from well, it. It's obviously quacking up, isn't it? Coming back in time on the sides of the nation, it's the Caroline Flashback. Hmm. We're not getting any recording are we? Not, nothing going through. I think it's obviously quacking up, isn't it? Coming back in time on the sound of Where's my glasses so I can read what's on the front of the machine? Right, that one's for radio, and that one's for a microphone. So basically. Does it let you plug a microphone in for record or is it for PA? I do not fucking know. Because that's going through there. Let me just try something. I'll be back in a minute. Let me just put you on pause a minute, folks. I want to just look at somewhere. Right now, I want to talk about your sleep. How did you sleep last night? Not too well? Or you're probably saying, mind your own business. Anyhow, how did you sleep last night? If your bedtime drink was Horlicks, then I know for a fact that you enjoyed that night. Didn't you? The sleep that replaces lost energy and relaxes tired minds. If your mind tired, it is. Well, with Horlicks, you sleep till you wake up. Right. 
Make it right, well, I just need to look into that, folks. It's not recording. Um, I've tried it, it's not recording. So, there's an issue with it not recording. And there's also an issue uh, with the level of volume. And I think it's the tape head. I think it's the tape head, folks. I don't really do, honestly. Anyway, what I'm going to do, I'm going to... Uh, I'll tell you what, I really, really wish... And I mean this, I really, really wish I had a valve tester. It's the only piece of equipment that I haven't got that I could really do with and I'd get a lot of use of. I could really, really do with getting my hands on a valve tester. Anyway, <coughs> if anybody's selling such an instrument, uh, in good working order, I don't want one I have to piss about repairing, I want one that works, but works correctly. Uh, but uh, anyway, I'm gonna leave it there now, folks. Uh, you know, we, you know, we, we, we've got one objective. You know, we've done one objective. We've that's a bit crackly though. But we've done one objective. We've got the tape recorder working in the point where it will play a tape. So, you know, I'm sort of happy at that because when I got it, as you know, it was all jammed up as. Uh, You've seen me working on it over the last few weeks. But I'm really getting there now where, you know, I want to crack on with it now. But I can't now because I need to find out whether I need valves on the tape. I definitely need a tape head. Uh, I think that's its issue. But I'm going to look into it deeper. Anyway, folks, uh, thank you very much for joining me for this series. There will probably be one final video. Well, I know they will. Because I know you're going to want to hear it record and play back and... You know, you've followed it all this long, all, all the way, all this long for over time, so... Bit of shame if you didn't. So... You know, that's it folks, and thank you very much for watching. And, uh, more to come later. Bye for now.